India's adoption of digital technology in governance has revolutionized the delivery of public services, eliminating corruption and ensuring accountability. With a robust digital infrastructure in place, the nation's future in e-governance hinges on the smart use of open-source software, the integration of AI, machine learning, and blockchain, and public-private collaboration. India's Gram Swaraj 2.0 envisions every village, no matter how remote, having access to public services. Open-source software is a linchpin in achieving this vision. It provides an affordable, customizable platform for leak-proof service delivery. India's vast and diverse population benefits from the flexibility of OSS-based solutions. OSS's popularity is growing due to its cost-effectiveness and adaptability. Government agencies can tailor OSS products to their needs, avoiding vendor monopolies. Popular e-governance services like Uman and Ayushman Bharat rely on OSS. Artificial intelligence is revolutionizing grievance redressal and decision-making. AI-powered platforms categorize complaints, speeding up resolution and identifying systemic flaws, as seen in the Integrated Grievance Management System. To ensure widespread adoption, AI solutions like IGMS should extend to all states. Challenges like non-uniform digital infrastructure, limited illiteracy, and inadequate manpower need addressing. The government should strengthen digital infrastructure, make common services centers more accessible, and provide continuous training for officials. India's digital public infrastructure has fueled economic growth and inclusivity. Initiatives like Aadhaar, Uman, UPI, and GEM have transformed service delivery. However, equitable distribution of services remains a concern. Efforts like the Urban Platform for Delivery of Online Governance aim to standardize digital infrastructure. Innovative approaches, like offering government services through WhatsApp chatbots, enhance accessibility and usability. To bridge the digital divide, India must expand digital infrastructure, encourage public-private collaborations, and increase investments in underserved areas. The government's commitment to digital India must be reflected in budget allocations. In conclusion, India's journey to e-governance 2.0 shows significant progress, but challenges persist. With continued investments, collaboration, and technological innovation, India can realize its vision of a fingertip republic, ensuring seamless access to public services and governance for all its citizens.